Hello guys, here's Roman from Tentech. Today I'm gonna show you how you can create this potion in Blender in a few simple steps. First hit A and delete everything in the scene. Then add a new circle with Shift A and reduce the vertices to 8. Switch into edit mode with Tab and go into side view with numpad 1. Press F to fill the circle, scale it down a little bit and extrude it with E. Scale it with S and repeat. Select the top face loop with Alt and right click and extrude it along the normals with Alt and E. Select the top two edge loops with Alt and right click and press Ctrl B to bevel it. Select the top face and go into side view with numpad 1, switch to wireframe mode with set and extrude it down. Now you can switch back out of wireframe mode again and go to object mode. The potion looks a little bit boring so I'm gonna add a little ornament. For that I'm gonna hide the potion with H and add a new circle with Shift A. Go into edit mode and move it on the x-axis. Rotate it 90 degrees and scale it down a little bit. I'm gonna add a modifier. In the modifiers tab you can find the modifier screw modifier. Adjust the length of it and I want two iterations. Now unhide the potion with Alt H and scale the ornament down. Move it into position. Mine is a little bit too long, so I'm gonna scale it down in the modifiers tab. Looks nice to me. I'm gonna apply the modifier, switch back into edit mode and fill the holes. In the screw modifier the default shading type is smooth. I want to change that by pressing W and shade flat. Now it's time to add the materials. I'm gonna select the potion and I want mine blue. So I'm gonna add a material and make it blue. I'm gonna play around with the material settings. I'm gonna make it a little bit transparent and less rough. Now select the ornament. I'm gonna make mine green. Add a new material, make it green. Looks nice to me. The last thing that's missing is the cork. So I'm gonna add a new circle. Move it up on the set axis and scale it down until it fits. Go into edit mode, fill it with F and extrude it. Scale it and shear it. Move it down and scale it until it fits and I'm gonna make mine brown.
gonna turn up the roughness a little bit. And I'm happy with it. I hope that you could learn something new in this tutorial. If you liked it, please leave a like and subscribe. And we're gonna see you next time. Goodbye!